Welcome to Tracking Progress, Goals and Displaying Data, part of the Mastering On Trajectory tutorial series. In this video, we'll take a closer look at how On Trajectory allows you to track your progress against your assumptions, and we'll discuss why this is such a powerful and necessary part of building a successful financial life model. Notice that this individual has accumulated several years of data behind them. Their past progress is represented by the green area in the graph, and it represents this user's actual account balances over those years. If you're new to On Trajectory, you likely haven't seen this green area, since it takes time to accrue the data plotted here. However, you can always zoom in on a section of the graph by clicking and dragging over a particular range. Click Reset Zoom to return to the full view. A dashed gray line begins where the green line ends, and this is a projection of the last progress update forecasted into the future. In other words, the dashed gray line, called projected progress, illustrates how current market conditions might impact the future if your percent growth assumptions were extended directly from that point. However, this line is extremely vulnerable to market volatility, which is why it's gray and why it's dotted. In this example, projected progress is currently above the individual's trajectory. However, a couple of down days in the market, and it could easily be the other way. At various points in the past, we can see progress was far below their trajectory, particularly in the 2008 timeframe, which of course corresponds to the Great Recession in the US. It is for these reasons that we base an account's growth on the original start date, allowing you to create a long-term financial plan that is buffered against natural market volatility. There are two ways to update your progress, either as a single total amount or at an individual account level. If you are using a tool that automatically aggregates all your account balances together, it's easy to copy and paste that amount into the progress field located here. Once you enter the amount, click update and the graph will automatically zoom in on your progress to date. It will also display the percentage amount you are either above or below your trajectory for the current date. To update progress at an individual account level, go to progress history and click update progress by account. The pop-up shows your current trajectory and the amount at your last update. This is a handy tool for determining whether your average growth is set correctly at an account level. Again, don't attempt to adjust your growth percentages with every run-up or dip in the market. But when you can clearly see, over time, that your growth assumptions are incorrect, adjust them. This is how On Trajectory helps you build confidence in your future and helps you become your own financial fortune teller. When you update progress, a new entry is added to the progress history table, which you can edit by clicking on or delete if necessary. Finally, let's take a look at the Goals tab. There are two types of goals. First, you can forecast the date that a certain amount will be attained. In this example, our user wants to know the date their trajectory will reach $500,000. The date calculated is displayed, and we can plot it on the graph by clicking the Show checkbox. The second type of goal calculates a growth rate needed to reach a certain amount by a certain date. This individual wants to know what growth rate is necessary to hit $1 million by January 1, 2025. Again, the result is displayed in the goal table, and clicking Show plots it on the graph. Goals can be sent on either your trajectory or your projected progress. This means you can compare how current market conditions may either delay or accelerate your savings targets. As we see here, because this individual's progress is currently above their trajectory, if market conditions continue, they would reach their goal of $1 million in assets a year earlier than planned. Of course, past progress is no guarantee of future gain, but it's good information to understand in any case. Lastly, if you're a data junkie and interested in how the sausage is made, click the Show Trajectory Data button. You can view the underlying data for your income, account items. On the Accounts tab, you can even navigate through each individual account and see how funds flow in and out, how taxes are calibrated, etc. All of this data is rolled up on the Grand Total tab, which, in addition to the calculations produced from your items, also shows your track progress, as well as other information useful for future planning. Again, please see the other tutorials in this series to learn more about how On Trajectory can help you model a successful financial future, to be used now 
and for years to come.